Does it look okay? Does it look bad? I think it looks alright. Yeah, alright. Looks, looks alright. It's, it's a, yeah, it's, it's a pink, it's a pink show. What up, Mr. Heal? Alright, I'm back. Are we live then? <laughs> Alright. You know what? I'm gonna say it, but I cannot. My microphone isn't coming through though. Now it should be. I don't know why my microphone was. Now you can hear me, right? Uh, I. Okay, Mr. Mr. Heal can hear you. Excellent. That's what we like to hear. <laughs> Here we go. What's the life without a Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Uh, I don't think you're gonna be knock on all the types of wood, but I don't think you're gonna hear a lot of technical difficulties this time. Reached the surface lately, cousin. And this can only mean some unforeseen impediment. He says very confidently. Should I want dash or attack? I want dash to deflect. I'm hearing a lot of like do doops, -do -doops, but I don't know what it is. Little doop -do doops. Yeah, I don't want. I don't want those noises. You want any bloop -de -bloop doobly doops? I really don't. Notifications, turn them off. Oh, is that what you were hearing? Yes, I'm turning them all off. Are they yours? They pro they're probably not yours. They're not mine. I don't use notifications. There. I've turned them all off. Yeah, the no, stream looks good this time. I like the uh, I like the ability to like see what you're doing. I think it's really gonna affect um, people's <laughs> view of things. Yeah, it's not abstract art this time. Yeah, it's it's not as um, I don't know. I, I you know it did give it's our not, it's not as artistic. <laughs> it gave our channel something a little a little I say quoi. Yeah, I yeah. a little moose bouche. <laughs> But I don't know how long this is gonna last. If your wife starts streaming stuff, then uh, well, it that's the ball game. Any moment. That's what they call the ball game. Hmm, I don't like any of these that much, so I don't even know. I guess we'll do that. He just grows stronger. He just grows stronger. Delayed Borat voice. Oh yeah. Borat. <laughs> My wife. Now that I'm all set up, I can enjoy my very adult beverage. Nice. Extremely adult. Is it that sugar-free wine? No, but that was pretty good. It's not sugar-free, it just has no additional uh, sugar. It's not sugar free, it just has no sugar. It's not no sugar, it's no additional sugar. Um, yeah. I, right now I'm drinking um, a classic, if you will. Um, it's, a li it's a little bit sophisticated, I will admit. I'm, I'm flexing here. Uh, but it's it's a little beer called Modelo. Mm, very nice. A little south of the border action. A little south of the border action happening. I too like to dabble in the foreign tastes. <laughs> Having what they call a cerveza. <laughs> Very exotic. It's so exotic. It is. I can't even tell you the flavor. Extremely beer. You wouldn't. Very beer. <laughs> you wouldn't mistake it for anything else. <laughs> I Rockefeller. I am living life outside the law here. I'm just with, over here trying the, to live moss, you know. The <laughs> Having some fourth meal. <laughs> We laugh, but I mean, apparently it was a very excellent marketing strategy because we all know. 
We all know. Yes. We all know. Well, and also, if you're drunk and you're going to get food and you don't want to spend a bunch of money, or you're drunk and you spend a bunch of money by getting 16 tacos, Taco Bell is the place to do it. I mean, that's right. Sometimes if you just want dinner for your family. Good idea. I only like all soup, soup for my family. Wall, yeah. soup, family. Wall, 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 Lollipop. <laughs> um, but I, I probably, I don't eat a lot of fast food, but if I'm, if I'm driving and I need to slap on a feed bag, I'll go to Taco Bell. Right. Taco Bell is apparently one of the healthier fast food options. <laughs> I mean, they have the most vegetarian options at the very least. Well, a lot of their food isn't fried. Right. So... That's why. And a lot of their stuff, you know, it's got some lettuce on there. Plus, you can get a hell of a lot of food for like $6. Exactly. And, you know, Subway can be healthy, but people often think, oh, I'm getting Subway, so it's definitely healthy. And <laughs> I get the, not... the double meatballs. Right. It's not always the case. I, um, Hi, I don't really like Subway. I, I think, like... You're being very there's something that weird about the taste of it. I'll eat oh, it if I, I love, have to. I love Subway. Get a get just a veggie sub. Every vegetable they have. Oh yeah. I mean, if I'm gonna go there, I'm gonna do that. But it, it, in terms of the sandwich pantheon, I'm gonna go Jimmy John's every time. Oh, absolutely, Jimmy John's is better. One hundred percent. But there is a Subway in about every three feet in any town. If they, they will have a Subway and not a McDonald's. Yeah, what is it? What's the next one like? Oh, I forget what the town is. The next one up like 231 or whatever. 421. <laughs> that town has nothing. And there's yeah. a subway. Oh, of course. The subway looks like it's in an old Dollar General, but it's still... It's there. Or if there's a Walmart in town, you know that Walmart's got a subway in it. I mean, it has to. What else would there be? I mean, some of them have a snack McDonald's. bar. Remember there used to be a snack bar in Walmart? There's a snack bar in Walmart? And then Subway was like, hey, you know what? That could be a Subway. I had no idea that it had a snack bar. Some Walmart, it's like, um, I don't know about the one in Lafayette, but... The in one where? In one where I work. In any town USA? <laughs> oh no, I forgot our long <laughs> uh, policy of never <laughs> saying a town's no, name. We can't let them find us. That's right. They'll know we were there storming the Capitol that day. Divine Dash. Oh, I want Divine Dash. Hmm. Okay, anyway, um, the Walmart in Avon, where I used to work in high school, had a snack bar. And it was like, I could get a little personal pan pizza on my break. I'd always get a personal cheese pizza. I'd put extra cheese on it. And I would put garlic salt and hot peppers, because those were like the free, you know, the packets. Oh, for sure. Packets. So many packets. For sure. And I would just like eat that pizza and watch The Incredibles because that's what was on the uh, display TV in the snack bar. <laughs> it was big... So I watched The Incredibles probably 50 times that summer, just in pieces. Like I'd catch a third of it here and a third of it there. That's right, Ethan. We are in a Google group together. Only about storming the Capitol. Because unlike a lot of people, our liberation comes from keeping fascists in power. They also had soft pretzels. Uh, and I they love had, soft pretzel. They had those pre-made muffins, you know, like individually wrapped muffins that always gave me heartburn, like instant heartburn. Oh my god! Have you? Don't ever look at the nutrition labels on those things. It is ridiculous. Oh, so bad. But people so are like, oh, I just had a, a banana, a banana nut muffin for breakfast. It's so healthy. It's like you just had 800 <laughs> calories, yeah. and it's all. Sugar. It said banana. Right. <laughs> same. It's the same as a banana. It has banana um, in the name, so you know it's good. I prefer a hard pretzel, like right now, like with this uh, cerveza. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. A nice, like hard pretzel would go so good. The with problem it. with a hard pretzel is that you you can't just have one hard pretzel. Oh, I agree. And you know what? Like the best kind of hard pretzel are that you don't typically see people eating. The big just ones. The big old fat ones. The big yes. old fat ones. Absolutely. People are always eating those like large skinny pretzels, you know what I mean? But the, like, no, the, the big chunky fatties. boys, those yes. little chunky fat ones, those are the best ones. They're so good. Um, I had two, bu they, 
they stopped selling them because they were like they were in October there for like uh, Oktoberfest but they had oh, yeah. like twisted pretzels that were like big and huge and like when you'd break a tooth on them they were so good yeah um, but yeah I when I had uh, break time so I used to work at a water park uh, a publicly owned water park uh, for the county and I think I was going to vlog about that one yeah yeah some people like wrote some stuff on a really popular website um <laughs> But on our breaks, we had like a break room because it was like not just, I was on oh, maintenance, room, which was, eh? <laughs> it was not just maintenance. <laughs> and uh, maintenance was, you picked up the trash, you cleaned the toilets. It was janitorial work. Clean um, the puke. But yeah, yes, empty the trash. I think most people are familiar with what, oh, but I guess it could be you to be talking to the y Yeah, yeah. And some people did that. It was just like the vast majority did. Yeah. Um, and especially if you're a teenager, they're not hiring you to fix the machines. Um, so we do that, and we had a break room, and every break, the only thing that'd be on the TV is soap operas, because it would be, like, in the middle of the day in the summer. So we all got, like, into, like, days of our lives and stuff. While we'd go to concession stand, and they give us a wink and a nod and let us steal food. I got so many Dippin' Dots. Is that the end of the story? Yeah, yeah, we were just talking about work, right? Oh. <laughs> and then someone died. <laughs> I just thought there was going to be something about something about that happened in the break room. But it's like, no, I had a job, and sometimes we had breaks. No, I mean, the job was terrible. Um, and we did have breaks. We did have OSHA called on us because they made us go outside and pick trash in the lightning. Because they were like, this isn't an ocean. That's correct. They were, they were like that. Um, <laughs> any town water park, any town website, any time, any town break room, any town trash. People can die at water parks, and I would not be surprised if someone has died there. I know people have gotten injured there. There also was. It was so weird, and I, I wish I could find the website. I might try to like spend some time and actually track it down. But there was um. There's a really weird guy. He was a real big, weird, creepy guy. And um, so big, big as in he was a big creep. Like, uh, not the size of him. I think I only saw him like twice. But what he would do is he like would come and he'd get a season pass every every year. And he'd come and he'd talk to the, the lifeguards, which these lifeguards, mostly teenagers, mostly in high school, some like in college, but young uh, relatively. And he'd like hit on him and do like weird creepy stuff and then Solid. his whole bugbear was he would count his whole bugbear? yeah like his whole thing his whole steez was he would yeah. do that and then he would count the number of steps he took well, he so he'd be like today I added 47 steps of climbing up the water slides or whatever oh, and is he this, this is the guy in the, 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 the website take yeah he had a website it's no longer yeah around but he would like take pictures with the lifeguards and like he would it was just it was very creepy and like everybody knew him um because it was like weird i don't think anything um nefarious ever happened which was good huh, i'm it says slay foes without getting hit. I've never been in here before. No, I've never seen this room. Area. So I don't really know what's going on, but I'm trying to just like zoom around and let my shield do the the slaying. You know what I said? I said slay. I did get to play Hades. I, I got one run in this week outside of the stream. Hold the onions. Wow. So I'm one run stronger. Nice. I guess I'll go for this palm. Oh, yeah, juice mm. corn. <laughs> I love a good juice corn. <laughs> I don't know. I'll go so, Ethan, how have you been in any town USA? doing anything. I guess that was worth it. That's your doing business. 
<laughs> We've never mentioned your real name before. And that no. we didn't get to the bottom of the fact like that your name's an anagram. <laughs> no, my real name. Does that mean you lose your superpower because we said your name? Guessing it's like Rumpelstiltskin. <laughs> sure enough. Buffalo chicken mac for dinner. I don't Let's think I've ever had do, that. Red blood. Sounds pretty good. I love buffalo sauce. Give me a spicy anything. Anytime <laughs> tiring you. Um, I did get um the last run I did, I got a different fury. Nice, who was it? Electo or just the not this one. The one that goes murder. Yes, I think so. That was like a week ago. I can't remember that. It is, I can't tell you, the experience of seeing your screen not be a smear of color. It is just <laughs> so much better. It's beautiful. Oh, I, I really like your hair, Ethan. It's great. My what? Uh, oh. Ethan said you see his hair. Yeah. Uh, Mike. When he moved or something, he dyed his hair a very similar color. And if you scour, scour the annals of the internet, there is video of him with his dyed hair. Somebody had a really successful vlog, and a lot of people loved it, and there might be some information there. I did have a really good vlog. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, right. You did one, two, a couple. That's that thing. I had a lot of blogs, actually. Not blog, vlog. A vlog. Oh yeah, that was a really successful vlog. You. We do. I have... like how like how regular you updated it. Like you just posted very regularly. I, for yeah. a little bit, I did update it regularly. <laughs> There's like eight regular episodes, and then it fell <laughs> off the face of the planet. Right. So I'm gonna keep that, I guess. Oh yeah, he totally dyed his hair. It was when he was leaving his first job, I think. Uh, like his first out of college job. Oh no. Let's go up. Okay. And check. Um, we're what? getting some stuttering. Uh oh. Uh oh. Made it to Asphodel. Let's we'll see what happens. Did I stutter? Yeah. Mr. J. I'm Mr. J. Still looks okay. I really liked Mike's uh, apartment at his first job. Inferno bombers. Which one? The roach? The roach one? No, 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 no. The one uh, after the roach one. The one at uh, the now defunct university. Oh yeah. It's like a dormitory. Yeah, yeah. It was just very uh, cozy, charming. I don't remember much of it. It was that just was... like a, a room. Yeah, it was a room. It had two, two. And um, that was where Ad Lib first had their like like right. uh, first real practices because that was a great it, practice place too. It was so good. It was it was for plays and stuff, so it was just like a really great practice space. It was based, it was like a, a like a a set studio. Yeah, All yeah, it's where like they did everywhere. they built them and everything. Yes, Saint Schmoes. So my um, me, fishies. I sent a, if we had a friend uh, Mike Kaschelny, and uh, oh, he's still around, and. He went to said university, and my grandmother died recently, and so we've been, like, I took some of, uh, like, the stuff from her house, like, you know, what, what would you like, that sort of thing, and she had two <coughs> beer steins. One of them was from St. Joe's because my great uncle was, used to be a priest there and teach there, um, and I say used to because then he met his wife, and became not a priest anymore. Hmm. A feast for Egypt. But he was he was ordained. He was in the Catholic uh -huh. faith as a priest. But you, those two things don't mix. It's true.
believe you got into a fight with my professional associates. You daft or something, cuz. Just daft or something. Oh, man. He said cuz. Cuz. Uh, my... I had there was this guy who uh, now because I'm making connections. There's a guy who works at the water park. He was like a lead. He was like this uh, kind of douchey guy, and he would call everyone "cuz." And so he got the the like nickname "cuz" because he'd be like, "What's up, cuz? Oh yeah, you gotta you gotta clean the bathrooms, cuz." Oh man, I could fight him again. My late grandma randomly had a ball state shot class. <laughs> Why not? Interesting. We got priests and soap operas. Put some. I know it's it's a uh, it's an exciting day here on Tim and Matt Play. We're just divulging all of our secrets, or, or one of us is. I definitely want that. I just I feel like I should try to fight him again, even though he's really strong. Yolo. <laughs> Secret names. Oh yeah, here we go. Oh, we got priests and soap operas here. And soap operas. Secret locales. Oh, hi. Erebus. You, and me, you got General, this. Mate. Have you ever defeated? No, I've only fought him twice, and both times he, he totally wiped me out. It just seems like he's got, he's like a damage sponge. He barely takes any hits. I, know, I need to just learn his moves, really. You're in a pretty good place for it. Three death defiances. Right. You got the shield going yeah. for me. Looking good, not to jinx it. And then you just keep like. Ooh, I like his skull attack. That's a neat look. I, I will say, I, I really love the visual aesthetic of this game and the color. Oh, choice. yeah. It's very red and purple. Really great. Man, that. Red, purple, attack green. Hurts. hurts bad. Dark blobs across and then a side swipe. So, did you, um, like, 100% this game, Ethan? I mean, Tyrant Heal, not Ethan. It's definitely not his name. Would be my pleasure. Huh. I did some. Oh my gosh, my health. Oh yeah. Yeah, just. just ruined. If we go by the. Great, you're doing it now. You should just about have a chance. Should be okay. Yeah. If I keep dodging and. Mm -hmm. Sending attacks at him that. Oops. oops. I didn't mean to do that. Never. One more props. Oh my gosh. Very powerful. They really are. That wasn't good. No, the joke and those, what happened. Those, like, clouds that come in really hurt, and I can't time my deflects right. What does Aphrodite do? Uh, fires a big arrow. Oh, what is this music change? All right. I don't know, but it got serious. It did, it got serious? It was like a breakdown? Oh, no! Oh, I don't like that. Yikes. Oh 
my god. I'm glad you did something. Yeah, I shot a little arrow at him. Aphrodite. No. Ah. Oh. No. Brutal. That was close. Almost got him. That was close. Well, that was a good run. Yep. I guess. GG, I, GG, GG. I, I, guess it's my I, I thought I might. Yeah. I thought he might kill me, but I was like, no, oh, worth a shot. Please uh, excuse us momentarily as we make the switch. As we wow. switch, switch the the switches. As I make the switch. Thank you for SC Jane popped on. No, there there wouldn't be, but there should be now. You guys got audio now? It's because I switched over to the other setup. <laughs> that was just a little treat for the fans. Yeah, that was a little treat for the fans. I said I think I thought Veracity Jane just popped on and popped right back off. It seemed like you came and went. But in reality, you came here and stayed here. I'm going to try this. Can you see the OBS thing on, on Discord? Oh. Me? Yep. I'm sharing my screen on Discord. Um... I don't. Oh, wait, why? Wait, what are you doing? You should see our stream, but in Discord. Yes, I do see that. So it should, I, I'm hoping the latency is a little bit better so you can see things first. Oh. So you don't have to open Twitch up. I see. Well, I have Twitch up. Well, you can close it. I'm going to keep it up. Well, then I'll stop sharing. <laughs> so I can see the, well, you can share it if you want, but that way I can see the chat. Ah, I hear you. And participate in the chat. Well, if you could... Well, yeah, I guess you don't have to. I was going to say you could pause it, but it doesn't matter now that you're not broadcasting. Anyway, boring stuff aside, welcome to my portion. It's Matt's portion. And I hope... I'm not sure if there's a game sound. Do you hear the... There should be. Yeah, there should be. I'm not hearing um, any game sound. Okay. That's fine. Audio input capture. <laughs> oh, I'm sure the fans are just loving it. This is what they come here for. Okay. Yep, there it is. Sometimes, yep. like, uh, we've had problems where, like, Windows resets things. We need to, we need to uh, change the name of the stream. To tech, tech diff. Tim and Matt experience audio 
problems. Who's the best three-headed boy? Oh, but we have to pet the boy. Gotta pet the boy. Yes. The good boy. Blood and darkness, but this place is falling apart. Nobody works an honest day down here. Now there definitely should be audio, right? Blood and darkness. What would you even know of honest work? At least the wretched dead. Yeah, there's game audio. Yes, Lord. Gamadio. Cannot say the same for you. There's Gamadio. Sick. All right. Um, nobody wants to talk to me. <laughs> Oh, you mean in the game? Yeah, that's what yeah, I mean. in the game. <laughs> in the game, for sure, is what I meant. I uh, can't really do anything right now, so I have enough keys to unlock a new weapon, though. Nice. Anything on the list? Nothing. Oh, right. I'm so stupid. I should have used my... I have a little Chthonic companion, and I I just got them. It's like, That's I'm very right. new to the Chthonic companions. You don't have them yet. Um, but what it's is a this? Like, oh, it's amazing. You should play with that, for sure. It's a gun? Yeah, it's a gun. <laughs> <laughs> There's a gun in this game? Oh, yeah. What a uh, ridiculous anyway. thing. That you eventually you unlock these little trinkets that are called Chthonic companions, and basically you summon a little helper. Reload. If you're in a big fight, you can have it. I should have used it when I was fighting Karan. I didn't think about it. I'm not used to playing with them. Nice one. Anyway. I can't. I cannot believe there's a gun. <laughs> yeah, it's amazing. I'm going spear. I want to beat the game oh, with you spear. Oh, the gun. That's a new one. Chthonic coin purse. I don't know if I should be able to hear your, your game or not through Discord. Nah, I don't think through Discord because I don't have that properly synced up, but... Alright, I'm just gonna... I'll just watch it then. But it should be quicker, so it before is, you're getting... Ahead. Okay. Um... I did, do you see how I have more now? <laughs> I do see that. So at the bottom, like the bottom row, the gold ones that are locked? Uh-huh. Those are what I was just talking about, the Chthonic Companions. It's like a little helper that Getting you back. get. You can oh, call nice. for aid. And I should like, have used it in my battle with Karan, and I just forgot. I have one equipped, I just forgot all about it. I'm so sorry. I'm not, I'm not used to using them yet. I, I'm new to them. Well, you know I don't have any. I do know that, I just saw it. There's no shame in your upbringing, Zagreus. In case you were wondering if there was any shame in it. No reason, just, just mentioning that. Yeah, it's just an offhanded comment, really. Yeah, no shame. Your attack is stronger and can deflect. Oh, but dash. see on the middle one? See on the middle one how it has that scroll symbol? Yeah. That means it applies to one of your prophecies. Okay, I don't like it. It's not as good, but it will help you finish a prophecy. It's pretty good, though, the cast. It's a pretty good cast. Yeah, I just, I like always forget to use it. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> what did Veracity Jane do? I came. Well, you know what? I say good for you. <laughs> no, good on you. I said, I said good for you. You know what I say? I said good for you. That's the eternal question. That is. Oh man, just ignoring that chaos gate. Oh, I didn't even see it. I was paying attention to the chat. I would have gone it with was, it. It was kind of behind the pillar. The cast is pretty meaty. Yeah, look at the old bomb. And it deflects. It's like so quiet. Like. I, it just seems so. There's no game noise that I can hear. So, whatever. <laughs> What's going I'm on? Talking, it's just so quiet. It's um, happening. 
and what I'm actually hearing, because I have my game minimized, is just like the quiet menu music <laughs> on mine. It just sounds extra awkward. So I feel like the Republican Party is just like solidly based on conspiracy theories now. I, just I, like I don't think that all of them believe it. I do think a lot of them believe it, but they also, it doesn't really matter e either way. Sure, they've just all embraced QAnon. And yep. They're like, this is who we are now. Well, I think we can we can bravely say now, we've heard from Marjorie Taylor Greene that... Um, you can get that pot, Matt. You can get it. You can get it. <laughs> no, I cannot. <laughs> that 9-11 did happen. Yeah, well, thank, thank God for... for for the truth finally we can we can rest we can talk about how 9-11 indeed did actually happen right oh my gosh but this is to me it's just like there's no difference now than there was before there's there's really there's nothing that's changed this is always who they've been sure sure but the fact that so many of them are are Good enough like eat. publicly like voting like Trump's not president anymore, you know. Like there, there's no. No, but their base. Like, their base, exactly. Which is insane to me. That's how they know that they're going to get elected because it's culture war stuff. They know that the policies aren't going to help them, so they're not running on policies. They never have. They're warring on nonsense. Yeah, and that gets them elected. Um, and it's ridiculous. there is legitimate grievances that people have, and they're providing something. It's not. It's not the right thing, uh, in my right, opinion. Right. Economically anxious. Is what uh, I mean, there are people who are economically precarious. I don't use that as an excuse for um, any sort of racist behavior. Uh, but the country's economic gaps are worse than they've ever been. I'll just take that. Correct. And because of Republicans. And Democrats. And Democrats going along with it. But I just, like... It's the. I, I, I'm not trying to equate the two. I'm not. I, right. It's. It, but they are like, Democrats in this country are so moderate to conservative anywhere else. There is. Um. There's a podcast, and they they made a good point. The Democratic Party should be the rightmost party that we have. That's it. Right. The way they are now. Yes. Yeah. Exactly. It shouldn't go further right than that. And it's really far right. It's really far. Yep. Like the fact that they are considered so left move, so left move. Yeah, I know. It's it's a hundred percent ridiculous. Um, Tyrant Heel, stop talking about our Google group. <laughs> no one's even posted anything besides me in that Google group. Yeah. Nobody wants to play nine eleven with you, Matt. Yeah, I I, good I'm going to do something like, one, that heinous, but two, like, in a Google group, because I'm extremely smart. <laughs> right. Or just, like, plan on some, like, really insecure social, new social network. <laughs> exactly. That's well, I mean, like, to be fair, like, like, the people who stormed the Capitol were, like, live streaming it, and they're like, Hi, my name's Debbie uh, Forsyth, <laughs> and I, I live at 42, like, Mulberry Lane, and we're here just storming the Capitol. But it's because they didn't see it as some sort of illegal activity. They right. thought it's like they are truly patriots liberating... Yep. And because it's it was just so ridiculous, but also kind of like sad for these people who are so gullible and yep. so taken advantage of. Do that. Absolutely. And it's still happening. Like the people in charge aren't trying to be like, listen, we're sorry. Nope. They're just like, yeah, you're you're right. And uh, we're going to keep fighting for you. Uh, yep. And because they know that it will get them votes. And that's ultimately what they care about. You'd say, what's Club Penguin? Is it a... Is it, is it a website? Why isn't people telling me things? <laughs> There's too many kinds of milk. <laughs> what is this? Sisyphus. I don't think I've ever the, done this. Ex the exclamation mark encounter is really great. Hey, Prince Z. Must look like I'm slacking Prince Zed. Old boulder here, but... Yeah, Prince Zed. That's you. Fury sisters don't often leave me be. Where'd they go? You're Prince Zed. And, um, 
Oh, I know. I I think I've only run into Sisyphus once. I didn't know that was the symbol for him. Well, it's like, or for um, Eurydice in Asphodel, or whatever the guy's name is in um, the third place. <laughs> <laughs> Which I can't think of right The now. third place. The third place. Speaking of, did anybody watch Castle Rock on Hulu? Mm -mm. Such a good show. Well, season one was fine. Season two was very good. It's like RuneScape with penguins. Thank Sounds you, delightful. Godspeed and all. Godspeed and all. Love Sisyphus. He's such a nice guy. He is just a nice guy with his boulder, his pal boulder. Yep. Old Boldy. <laughs> it's not just a boulder. It's a rock. Come on in. Like, is that a boulder or is it a big rock? It is windy outside right now. Oh my god, it's so cold. Only getting colder. And uh, windy. I am extremely glad that I have my treadmill set up. Um, mm -hmm. Which... Because I tried to go running the other day and almost freaking rolled my ankle, like, many times. Oh, yeah. I, I went for a few walks, like, some late-night walks just to get some steps in. Oh, I saw. I saw on RunKeeper. <laughs> oh, yeah. My, my walks. Well, I did that so I could um, log it, you know, later. But I uh, was walking, not the first time I went, but, but what did I go, last night? It was so icy, and I just kept sliding around. Like, I almost mm -hmm. beat it so many times, just walking. It's because people didn't shovel their walks. And exactly. so, I so tell annoying. you what, so people got to shovel their walks. It's really bad. It's old man grump hour, and people need to shovel their walks. They really do, though. It's really bad. I don't understand why. Even in super nice neighborhoods, it's like where they could definitely afford to have someone do it for them. Some of them didn't even look like they attempted to do it later. It was just nope. like thick snow with footprints. And why? So one time there was a storm and there was a bunch of debris, like a giant limb fell down on the sidewalk by my house. Yeah. And we noticed it the next morning as we were leaving our house to go to work, right? We saw this giant limb and I was like, well, I guess I'm going to take care of that after school mm -hmm. or after work, after work. Anyway, when, it, when we got home, there was After a After work, yes, at nondescript work location. <laughs> at job. <laughs> when we got home, there was a letter in our mailbox from the city saying if we didn't clear the sidewalk off, we could be subject to a fine of up to $1,000. And if the sidewalk was ever blocked again and it was noticed, we would get automatically a fine of $1,000. And it was like, that was up for less than 24 hours. Yeah, it, it really seems like it is um, when they notice. Because again... Uh, there are people who have disabilities and stuff like that. Why aren't the walks shoveled? Those are those exactly. are needed so for travel. If I don't get the grace period of a day to like clear a giant limb off my like most people don't have the the means to do that immediately. Most yeah. people are gonna have to call like it was a huge limb. I couldn't drag it. I had to cut it up first. Most people yeah. are gonna have to call somebody to come take care of it, and that's not gonna happen immediately. I was so annoyed by the letter. I was like, I'm, I'm sure it's because there was some like cop driving by and noticed yeah. it. Like you're just yeah. you're just in his path or in their I'm path. City employee, really annoying. So the fact that days later these people are still just Jesus. letting their sidewalks be a quagmire, icebergs to try to walk over. Real annoying is all I'm saying. It is very annoying. It is very annoying. But yeah, it made me think like, because I've... Every once in a while I'm like, oh, I should go for a run. But walking around, I am not running on this. Yeah, I... I, uh, the past, I hate doing it. I hate r treadmill running. It is my least favorite thing. Yeah, it's really um, bad. It's it just it feels like it's, it's while, torture. Out to reaches of Asphodel, and I have to it say, it feels like oh, you run for five minutes and you feel like you've been on there for an hour, and it's just so boring and awful. 
I I mean I did it for an hour today, and it's it's about the maximum I can do on a treadmill. Yeah, it's an hour. it's terrible. It's horrible. I used to do it at the Y all the time, and it was just so tedious and boring and awful. I did it like that one winter before we did the um, the coldest hustle race I've ever been a part of. But actually, got no, not that race. The Santa Hustle, which was not that cold. Oh yeah, no, that was good. That was fun. That spring race, the circular logic. Circular that logic. <laughs> so cold. That, that, was um, that was my coldest race until until I did Wisconsin last year or the year before. It was the most cold I've ever been, and uh, to the point where like somebody was serving chili at the end, and they're like, um, <laughs> "Do you want some of this?" Because I was just shivering, and uh, I was like, "Oh, well, like they were just like, no." What's that? Was it chili for racers or was it? For yeah, the yeah. Oh, but like, okay. I don't eat, I don't eat meat and chili, oh, okay. so it was, yeah. really didn't help. But I had to like before I could even go back to the car, I had to stop at a coffee shop because I was, I was way too, way too worse for wear. I was too cold. Yeah. It. What we actually, like? when we drove it's back, we actually went through a snowstorm. It was that bad. Like it, it turned quick. Wisconsin. Wisconsin. Symphony done. Out of here. For a while there, every time we went to Wisconsin to visit my wife's family, we would oh it would always be a snowstorm. Even if there wasn't one on the weather. We were planning there wasn't gonna be one. I was like, we should take my car instead of yours, because I have a, a Jeep. And I was like, we should always take my car when we go visit your family. <laughs> and every time there's a snowstorm. Well, father, I'm trespassing through your secret hall and going up. Um I should keep my thing on so far, right? I shouldn't change this. Mm. Let's see here. I'm what gonna do you keep want it. I'm keeping it. I wish I had changed mine. Up we go. <laughs> that is what you said. I would have had an extra, extra light. Ooh, Benton County got a delay, a two-hour delay. I mean, oh. some, some place, system, some, some place in the country. <laughs> Oh, people could pretty much pinpoint our houses at this point. <laughs> We've mentioned our addresses, our specific addresses. Whenever we it just came pizza, up in natural conversation. <laughs> what was even my plan? And must be the last of them. So yeah, earlier today I was thinking about those cheese bricks from that restaurant. I was thinking about hashtag food from hashtag restaurant. <laughs> oh my god, so I love redacted. food. Are you kidding me? Redacted from redacted. <laughs> um, they have the best redacted. Oh, uh, so so redacted. Yeah, those cheese bricks, man. I don't think Is I've ever right? had them. Oh my gosh. There's so there's this restaurant in my god. Uh, brackets town that we live in. <laughs> and they have these things called cheese bricks, and they're basically giant monsters. Oh, sticks. this is so good. But they're, you know, they're, what is it? That's it. Dash strike hits three times. This is, this is how, oh, what is that's this? The, that's the, that's what you just picked up. Oh. Huh. The dash strike uh, hits three times. Boom, yeah, boom. Th the last time I got really far was because I had that, that boon. Yeah, it's a good one. Anyway, the giant mozzarella sticks definitely agree. Uh, definitely recommend cheese bricks, giant fried cheese bricks. Man, I've been thinking about. I'm gonna, I'm probably gonna order a lot tomorrow. Oh yeah, another. takeout food's thousand, great. Thousand calories a piece. Just melting these fools, like some cheese sticks. That's right. Straight busted. What's well, good there, cuz? I interrupt my brothers and sisters all the time. Oh yeah. Let's go, let's go. Now we're doing it. Easy does it. Now we're in it. Now we're cooking with gas. That's right. Melting these fools. 
And I got a good cast too. A big, a big boy. Big, big boy cast? Is this the one you've had? Or did you change yep. it? Nope. Nice, 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 nice. Who is this? Who's what? The eye. Oh, that's uh, Athena. It's a shield. Ah, ah, ah! Now I'm thinking with Hades, that's right. My favorite power couple. Ooh, the Gorgon. The Bubans. The Bubans, I have the Bubans. Ah! Oh, oh, you're getting froze. You're getting froze in. Well, if people have any recommendations on what games you'd like to see us play. I didn't catch we are all eyes. All eyes are on our games. Oh, yeah, I don't like the mini and And hello and welcome. I don't like it either. This is one of the mini bosses I don't mind. I really hate both of the Elysium mini bosses. What is oh, Phalanx I shot? I love the Barge of Doom. The Barge of Doom is so easy and so fun. Barge of Death. So great. Wait to the party. All you have to do is kill the, the, the oh, good. blue gems for the chamber renovation. Easy peasy. Oh yeah, chamber renovation coming through in the pinch. That's right. Getting that fountain. My least favorite mini bosses are the um, uh, butterfly, the soul orbs in Elysium. And soul the orbs. Soul orbs. And definitely the, uh, the Minotaur is always. He he's easier to, to kill now, but for a while that's where I always got stuck. The butterfly ball is horrible. Worst mini boss. It's it's so bad. I do not choose doors in Elysium that have the little skull icon on them because I know that it could be the butterfly ball. And I'm like, no, I'm not doing this battle. Not worth it. Not worth it, man. Oh yeah, the butterfly ball or whatever. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> yeah, you know what we're talking about. Yeah, you know, I'm I'm like really hip and cool and, and on the game. I think it's inter interesting that Tartarus sort of has three mini bosses. There's the the Doom the Doomstone, which is a pretty pretty fun one. Then there's the two like bomb throwers that kind of belong in Asphodel, but they're also a mini boss in Tartarus. Said, Hi, the Ares cast with the blade. Is Animal Crossing. We we'd love to play Animal Crossing, except Tim can't play it. That's right, because I don't have. I'm not a Nintendo kid. Yep. And he doesn't have a capture card on top of that. True. And why is that important? Because if you were to stream Switch, you would have oh, to yeah, be able yeah, to yeah, capture yeah. it and send it to me. I mean, if I just switch, you could probably work. I actually right out. have two extra capture cards if you if we needed it. <laughs> it so, what? I just knew that, like, I I was gonna say if I had a switch, I'm sure we could work it out. And right when I said that, you said I have two extra ones. Yeah. Like, well, I found some really good, high quality, cheap ones from like China, so I just have them hanging around in case. Well, yeah. Too bad no one wants one. I know. I haven't heard of. I haven't. I haven't heard of a single person wanting one. So you just keep those locked up. I will tell Lionel. I will give you uh, the link. They're like twenty bucks. They just plug into your USB port, and they're they're not as good as like the the best quality ones, but they are surprisingly good for the price. Yeah, Wish has some good stuff. It's not on Wish. <laughs> Daily Steel. Is it Daily Steel? It's it's eBay. Daily eBay. The daily eBay. 
I was looking at, uh, you know, some, some Chinese products the other day, and so there's these little notepads, so like post-it notes. Uh huh. But when you tear the page off, it slowly like builds a little 3D model of a building or whatever. Like what's left, layer by layer, builds a little little model of a building. It's pretty cool. And the That's one I was looking cool. at was like Hogwarts. I was like, oh, this is really cool. And it was only thirty dollars. So, so it's expensive for a pad of paper, but like it's a little bit of But I was suspicious, you know, of the website. So I googled it, and there's a, a ton. There's a ton of the same product on a bunch of different websites. You know? So again, suspicious. And then I found the original. It's like an article about it by this company, this German company. It cost two hundred dollars. Nice. And Got it. These Chinese knockoffs are thirty dollars. So I'm like, off? No? what's what's it gonna look like? I didn't buy one. I kind of want to. I'm like, what's it gonna look like? Down from two hundred dollars to thirty dollars. Yeah. And it might be fine. Like it might just be like, oh, they just copied it and you know set up their machinery or whatever and just crank cranking them out. But uh, you know, I'm skeptical. You surpassed my high drop. I did. I surpassed it. Correct, I'm going anyway, in here with two death de death defiances, still intact, and almost full did, health. Did you grab that that skelly tooth? No. I don't think. Didn't, didn't want that third death defiance. Everything's so great. I didn't. I don't know if I have it. Oh, I didn't look and see the uh, the little gift or whatever from Skelly. I th I gave him something. Yeah, so you probably have. It. I think you have it. I think I saw it first time. If you use it, it gives you a, another death defiance. Oh, it's pretty clutch. That's why I'm kind of kicking myself for not flipping it when I went uh, when I after I got out of. Um, Whatever it's called. <laughs> when I went. But I didn't know I was going to be fighting. We never do. On, so. And I had three death defiances and still beat me. Live and learn. And then. That soul's. One of those is going to come back. Oh, you got it. You got it. You got it. Everything has armor laser. It's so annoying. Red 13, have you fought Karan yet? And have you beaten it? The last. Yeah, everything has armor. Yeah, I haven't beat him yet. I fought him three times and thrice defeated. I was using the shield. You missed it. It was on this stream. Actually, it's true. that happened to me both streams. The past two streams. And the stream quality was pretty decent the whole way through. It was not a smear. Last two streams have ended with me getting killed by Karan. I'm just not patient enough with some battles to like wait behind the shield. I'm just and I, I even had like the Zeus shield and the um, Ares call, but I just like, I'm too impatient, so I rush him and then I get smacked. Also, I had, I had um, maybe the wrong uh, heat on to fight him, like it probably gave him higher health. My reward. The choices in uh, whatever you call it. The Pact of Punishment or whatever. Probably made him stronger than it should have been. <laughs> Maybe I'm the curse. I don't know. Uh, you might be the curse for Tim, but um, I'm doing very well this, this go around. Yeah, doing pretty good. I'm, I've like maxed out the more mobs one. And now I've been adding, like, that mobs have more health, 
and then I added the one where the mobs have a little shield, like the blue extra hit they get at the beginning. I this last run was heat five for the shield. I didn't clear it though. <laughs> Um, and I don't know if I cleared four. I think I cleared four, but if I didn't, I just wanted to get the the items from the first few up. stages. So I oh, sometimes yeah. I up the heat, even if I haven't. Even if I, haven't it, I want. I'm trying to gather materials. So. We meet again, short one. Yeah, exactly. I want more Titan's blood. So my shield, the heat, and I just got the Titan's blood. So I'll probably up it to six next time I do a run with it. Dionysus. What'd you say, Dionysus? Oh, it was that the reward for this? Yeah. Got the fight. Asterius. Full of Minos. I didn't know the Minotaur had a name. It's O A or O. Oscar Mayer, whatever it is. <laughs> oh, I'm That's focusing on this. My focus in. Not the sky. That's where clouds are born. Wait, what? Well done. My second favorite is about Bell's on a joke, thank you, yes. <laughs> Sometimes you just gotta cut bait. <laughs> Look, man, I am feeling generous right now. Know what I mean? And so he's something extra potent. Extra potent. All right. Ooh, that's a good one. Yeah. Dionysus is thick. Which which one did you get? Uh, the one where a fountain will restore 100% of my health. Oh yeah, that one's so good. And it doesn't it make your damage a little higher too? I'm not sure. Yeah, strong drink is the first. Was it in the gas station vending machine or trucks that vending machine? I don't know. They also have really fun glow in the dark balloons. And balloons that taste like different fruits. Uh, I want to do that, but I don't think I should. Yeah, those are rough in Elysium. They're so I slippery, don't I don't know why. Yeah, I honestly don't understand how anyone beats the game. Like, actually finishes the final fight with any weapon besides the shield. I, I don't know try. what the last fight's like. Oh, I'm assuming you face Hades, that's just my assumption. I don't know why you would assume that. <laughs> Not the name of the game or anything. It's called that because it's set in Hades. Right. No, you're right. You gotta get that blue thing. I got him. You got him. Oh my god, you're Hurl for Sir Earl. I know.
The gauntlets are super fun. Punch, 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 punch. You don't play Mario at the end of Mario. Mario, Mario. The Mario Luigi brother. Mario. You don't Mario's play that. You're not playing the right Marios. My favorite of video game final boss is when you have to fight Zelda at the end of Zelda. Or Metroid. At the well, actually, that is true. Never mind. <laughs> I'm bailing on this joke again. We got two bails. Oh, it's so funny. <laughs> this is what happens when half my brain is working at something, and the other half is playing this game. You don't fight the spin ball at the end of something. You are the spin ball. You are the spin ball. Ah, oh, it's such a good game. We should play it again. We did play it. We went all the way through it. Yeah, so we should play it again. <laughs> There's we so many other on... games. We don't have to replay Vangers or whatever. We and and Sonic Spinball. We should actually play Vangers on Twitch. Just saying. Or just, you should just play it on Twitch. And I'll Just me? Yeah, no, honestly, you should. And I, I hate the way that game plays. But that's because you were playing it by yourself and you didn't know how. No, that game, like the controls, it makes me yeah. mad. They've actually revamped the controls, apparently. Which I, I can't I, imagine that they've done much to it. I haven't played the game since, and I feel like I won't know how to play. Stardew Valley is a really tough boss. <laughs> anyway, yeah, I'm looking forward, to, looking forward to our things. <laughs> chariots, the big chariots are annoying. The small chariots. I oh yeah, the exploding them. ones. Like you know that the the game knows, or the game developers knew that those were an annoying enemy uh -huh. because there's an item you can buy. That ensures that no more of those will show up the rest of the time in a easy. Like one of the items from the Well of Caron is like I forget what the little chariots are called, but it it's basically it says that those won't show up again. Yeah, they're so beefy. They don't and they're so hard. Get away from me, God! Uh festive fog really helps against. Festive fog. Yeah, wheels of fire. Because <sighs> they couldn't call them chariots of fire. Exactly what I need. Nice. Yes. Oh yeah, that's a good one. Demeter skills. Oh yeah, the cold is good. This is my free one, right? Or now? Yeah, I think so. It should be. Um, I think I'm Could gonna you, go to the yeah, shop. No, 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 no. Oh. You won't be able to afford anything. You only have 114. Maybe some health you can afford. Yeah, that's what I was going for. Yeah. Perfect. That's exactly what I wanted. He doesn't even want to talk to me. Go get that Ambrosia. Alright. I've never beat this boss. Time for the main event. So. Oh, Theseus. ABD. Always be dashing. I never well, stop dashing. I can't stop dashing. I can't stop you dashing. You monster. <laughs> I know, he's so like... It is nice, though, if you beat the Minotaur earlier, that it starts this battle with lower health. Well, you kind of have to kill the bull first because it just chases you around the map. But honestly, probably a third of the time I end up throwing Theseus, Theseus first because I'm just like throwing the shield and the um, rift in the, into the middle. Nah! And they're in it. Man, dodging that spear is so annoying. Gotta go behind the little pillars all the time. The, our unsurpassable bullhorn technique. Mm -hmm. 
I don't know, man. Plus, once you knock Theseus down to a certain point, then the gods start yeah. attacking. It's really annoying, so getting the, the bull down first is, is, makes the fight easier. Because when he gets his, like, little recharge, it's just he's a little stronger and shoots those blades out when he smacks them. Smacks his axe. Smacks his axe. It's fun that he has an axe. Taros in Brawlhalla is also a bull man with an axe. That's fun. The bull defeated? It's nice that your dash deflects. It is. It's my last chance. Poseidon! Uh, Red 13, have you used a god's, like, full call against them in a battle, a god, uh, trial? Yeah, they don't appreciate it. Um, I had Ares, so I got to turn myself into a Blade Rift, and I on purpose so I get the Steam Achievement, but... Uh, I definitely lost that fight. I had three death defiances, or maybe it was just one or two, but I shouldn't have lost it normally, but because I used that, I just, he just threw so many more enemies at me. And I was like, worth it for the achievement. Like, that's all I wanted. Yeah, so, and I used the full call. Oh, no, that's why I, because I lost all my death defiances charging up my call getting damage so I could use my full, my greater call, and it was against him. He said, like, big mistake or something. Some no! Quiet, pithy line. Ah. Uh, uh, that was rough. I was close. That was, was about close. as close as I got last time. That was a close one. Next time. No, we'll man. Next time. F's in the chat. <laughs> F's in the chat. Yeah, that skelly tooth is is nice. If you had equipped the skelly tooth, you would have gotten it. I think you're probably right. I think you're probably right. Because you would have had an extra death defiance. Yeah. And that death defiance gives you more health than the normal one. Well, everyone, it's been fun. We both had heartbreakers on these we defeats. Did. We did. We did. We did. Uh, thanks for stopping by. Uh, I don't know what we're going to do next week. Maybe we'll do this again. Maybe we'll do something else. We'll but as always, thanks for uh, uh, I stopping we were by. Playing, uh, Vengers next week. Yeah, I'm. Uh, I have to talk to my lawyer. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, we'll see everybody next time. On the next time. Bye.